This learning is Le'ili Nishmas, Broya Bas Hananya, Seches Kilayim, Perik Beis, Mishnah Yud. In the previous Mishnah, we learned that the Chachamim hold that if a person wants to plant different species in areas of a base reva, they need to have a separation of a base reva between one species and the next. And our Mishnah teaches about this, that Kol Shehu Beseich Beis Reva, anything that's in this area of the base reva that separates one species and the next, so Eila B'Midas Beis Reva, it counts in this area measurement of a base reva. For example, if there's a ditch with water, even though the person can't plant there, it's still included in the separation of a base reva, and it will be enough of a separation between one species and the other. Achilas hagefen, the area that the vine eats up, meaning the area that's needed for working the vine. So a person can't really plant there anyway. Vahakever, in a grave where a person can't plant. Vahasela, in a rock where a person can't plant. Nevertheless, the halacha is that oilen bimidas beis reva, they're included in this measurement of a beis reva to separate one species and the next. The Mishnah now continues and teaches about the separation that's needed between two species that are being planted near one another. And we're going to talk about species of grain and vegetables. And we're talking about where the person wants to plant a square area. So if it's tvua, bitvua, if the person wants to plant two different grains, for example, wheat and barley near one another, so then the separation that's needed is a base reva, which, as we said, is an area of around 10 amas by 10 amas. If it's yarak be yarak, one vegetable near another vegetable, so then the separation that's needed is shisha tvachim, which is one ama, about one and a half feet. What about if it's a grain with a vegetable? So here we have an argument. If it's tvua be yarak, if it's a grain with a vegetable, or yarak be tvua, vegetable with a grain. So the Tanakama says that the separation that's needed is base reva. The separation that's needed between two grains is also the separation needed between a grain and a vegetable. And Rabbi Eliezer, Eimer Rabbi Eliezer says that if it's yarak betvua, if it's a vegetable with a grain, so then we go by the measurement that's needed between two vegetables, which is only shisha tvachim, six tvachim.